Hello and welcome back to another video on Unpack Technologies. In this video, I'm going to be unboxing the Opal Mobile Smart Flip Phone. This is a phone that's aimed for people who are more in their senior ages of life with a really simple smartphone experience to make it easy to use. So let's get straight into it. Alright, so this phone retails for around 150 Australian dollars, but it can go on sale for cheaper as it has been out for a few years at this point. And what it is, it's essentially a flip phone that has a small screen with Android running on it. It's a very basic stripped down version of Android, but it allows for basic smartphone features for seniors to be able to use a smartphone in a super simple way without much of a learning curve. So if we have a look around the box here, you can see that it has 4G network and it's unlocked, as well as a touch screen with 2.8 inches and emergency call with Bluetooth. Now, and it shows a photo of the phone on the front. On the right hand side, it just says Smart Flip. On the back, it gives an overview of what the device looks like in all its different configurations and more of the specs here. And then on the left-hand side, it's just got a bigger version of all of those specs, including an FM radio, social media, media apps, and expandable memory. So lots of great features there. On the top, it just says Opal Mobile. And on the bottom, there's just some serial numbers and other barcodes. So now what we can do, uh, it also says, just before we get into this, Australian designed and Australian owned. So I'm not sure whether this is available in other countries, um, but yeah, it's definitely an Australian brand. So what we can do is we'll get my unboxing knife here and just make a cut down here to uh, get into the product here. There we go. All right, rip the plastic off. All right, and we'll put that to the side. So now we can open it, uh, sort of, I think it lifts out. Oh no, there's another um, little bit of plastic here um, on the top and bottom. So another layer to get into. So we'll just do that there. All right, now we should be able to open it up. There we go. All right, pull it out uh, and we'll put the lid to the side for now. Uh, it says, thank you for becoming a part of Opal Mobile. It's just got some little uh, things there about reviews and all that. Put that to the side. Uh, on top, we can see we have the phone itself. I can get a grip of it, there we go. We've got the phone itself. We'll take a closer look at that in a moment and we'll have a look at what else comes in the box. So on this little bottom part here, we can pull that out and it's got the charging brick. So we've got the charging brick here with a USB-A on the bottom. And then a couple more cables here. We can pull this open. We've got um, micro USB to USB A for charging. And then in this packet, looks like it might be some earbuds. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we got some very basic earbuds here to go for your phone with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Uh, also in this bottom section, we've got the battery, which we'll go come back to in a moment. And we've got a user guide. So if I can pull that out here. Oh, this is the warranty card here. And then we've also got the user guide, which we might have to pull this part out firstly for. So we'll pull this part out. I'm not sure what's in here, so we'll have a quick look. Uh, and in here, oh, this is the charging dock by the looks of things. So um, this is... Uh, a way that you can charge your phone. So it plugs into the micro USB on the back and then on the top it uh, connects into the phone and it can charge on a dock. So that's handy if you would like to use that. And then it's got a massive user guide as well if you need that. So that's basically the unboxing experience there. And we'll take a closer look at the phone itself now. So we'll take it out of its little wrap here. And you can see it says Opal Mobile with a little screen on the front. 
and then we can open this up and you can see the whole phone itself uh, with some nice buttons uh, and it all seems to be built really pretty well. We've got a little camera on the front as well. And what we're going to do is slip this battery in. So if we can open this up. So to open it up, you just pull on this little pull tab on the bottom right. There we go. Pulls up. And then what we can do is put the battery into it. So I'm going to put the battery in here. Grab our battery and just insert it. A bit like the old school so the phone days, there we go. You've also got your, actually I'll put this out for a moment. You've also got your uh, nano SIM slots as well as the micro SD card options. And then we'll put the back back on with the battery in place. We do also have a handy SOS button as well. And just looking around the phone quickly before we turn it on, we've got volume up and down on the right hand side. On the left hand side, you've got your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and a micro SD port for charging. Sorry, micro USB, meant to say. And then on the front, you can see you've got all the buttons. So we'll turn it on here by holding down the hang up button. And then you can see it turns on saying open mobile. So we'll see how this goes. Um, from my understanding, I think this runs a fairly basic version of Android. So I think it's Android at the core with a skin over the top to make it nice and easy for uh, seniors or with people with hard um, vision impairment and things like that. So give it a moment to boot up here and we'll see how we go. All right, it says Android is starting. So that confirms it is running Android and now it's booted up. So you can see this is a touchscreen display here. Uh, so if we go through the different options, you've got on the first page, sort of like a speed dial, it looks like. Uh, on the home page, you've got the time with your messages and camera and things like that. The next page, you've got your gallery, your browser and your apps. And on the last page, you've got more like social media settings and also things like WhatsApp. So you can see that this is running a version of Android here. It's very stripped down, uh, trying to make it very easy to use for elderly people. If we go into settings, we'll have a quick look at what version this is running. Let's see if I can find it here. Uh, we got a system and about phone. And we can see that it is running the Android version 8.1.0 with the security patch level from the 5th of July, 2018. So it's a little bit outdated, but it will do for what seniors are wanting. So um, clicking the hang up button returns you home and you can also just use the buttons if you would like to as well, if it's a bit easier. But you've got full Android settings here. We've even got like a torch, uh, Bluetooth, things like that. So definitely looks pretty good from first impressions. Um, if we shut it, we should get the little display here as well. It thinks it's July, 2018. We'll have to fix that date, um, but it seems to be working quite nicely. You can actually hear some sounds here. When you open and close it, so that's a nice touch as well. So yeah, that's a basic overview of the Opal Mobile Smart Flip Phone uh, for seniors. Uh, hopefully this was helpful and gave you a good idea of what the unboxing and initial first look of this device is and whether it might be worth picking up if you're a senior or you're wanting to gift this to an elderly person as well, or someone who just doesn't want all the features of a smartphone, but just wants the basic functionality to be able to use some of those smarter features without having to have a whole new learning curve with it. And let me know in the comments below if you would like to see a follow-up review, maybe in a couple of weeks um, of using this uh, more thoroughly, so I'll know a bit more about it. Uh, just let me know in the comments below and also whether you're wanting to pick one of these up for yourself because I'd love to hear from you in the comments below. And with that, thanks for watching this video on Unpack Technologies. Don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video.